Good morning everyone, McButtface here, former community manager of Zogtar's community server. That was a mouthful. And unfortunately this video is about the truth of what happened. Now, by the truth I mean the full truth and not whatever versions you've been hearing from either Meltdeer or anyone else just trying to cover up what happened or, you know, trying to change events or alter the facts, you know. I'm here to tell you the truth, not just from me, but from everyone's POV that left the server and have an issue with what's been going on. <sighs> Let's start off with why I left the server. I left the server because I am tired of the disrespect, the refusal of communication, and both Zoktar and Meltir going behind my back. Behind Family Friendly's back, ignoring my moderation team, and not giving a shit about you, the community, all together. I have run this server for Zoktar for a year and a couple months. And I came in because at first I started helping Zoktar, not even with the server. I helped him test and, you know, pitch ideas for the game. I started off by helping with the first original FNAF 3. He had me test it. He, I was basically his tester. I gave him feedback. I told him what's good, what's bad, what to add, what to change. Then he, you know, invited me to help him with his backrooms game that, you know, it's gone. It never is gonna happen, but his backroom games, I helped him test that. I pitched him ideas. And eventually I offered to give him my help with the server because I'm great with people. I love the server. I love the community and I just want to help the people. So I, that day I joined the admin team and there were like, I want to say 10 admins and none of them like actually did shit for the server. They were just there for decoration or because they were friends of people and they paid for the fucking high rolls or whatever, but basically none of them did anything. So uh, I just decided I'm going to do everything by myself because no one else was actively doing anything for the server, for the people, for anything. So I decided I'm going to become the just manager of everything. I'm going to help with the game, I'm going to help with the server, I'm just going to help Zoktar where I can because I wanted to help him. And because I wanted to help him, I got others who also wanted to help him, or just help me, my friend, Family Friendly, who is currently the second community manager, or was the second community manager, because he was here when I was here, and quite frankly, because he is not as, and let's just say, he's just not as respected as I am, because he has had it far worse than me because when I'm upset, I make sure I have my voice heard. When he's upset, they ignore him. And then I have to go and speak on his behalf because they don't want to listen to us. But basically, we, we had enough. He never wanted to talk to us about any changes that he had. Communication was always an issue. I would have to find out things from other people who told people who aren't even related to the subject that found out that something was being changed somewhere and I wasn't told about it. Now I have to go and figure out, hey, what's going on? Why is it going on? Who did this? Why was this happening? Who, uh, what, what's this? I never knew what was going on. And this was strictly a communication error because they did not want to talk to us. This isn't the first time. This wasn't the last time. This, this is, this is absurd. It's not just me and family who's been having problems. It's been everyone that I got to help moderate the server. FBI, Kissnum, Duck, everyone. And to this day, moves were still being made behind my back because Zoktar did not want to tell me. Why he didn't want to tell me, I don't know. I go and I confront him. I ask him why, he just says, don't worry. I already planned this. I ask him, hey, next time could you give me a heads up? Or, you know, what's what's going on? I'm quite upset that this is still going on, communication errors. He plays it off. I find out from not even Zoktar, but someone else that a new community manager is just being hired on the spot. Not someone who's been in the community, not a member, not a staff, 
someone random outside the server no information about the community no dedication to the community just being promoted community manager with nothing just nothing now i have not slept in three days that's why i sound this fucking dead but i'm telling you i am pissed i am ultra pissed i'm pissed at zoktar because the lack of the communication and the lack of wanting to compromise i tried to ask him okay if you really want this dude, that's fine. I love working with people. You just can't give him community manager like that because he has not been in the server. He has not done anything. He does not know anyone. Nothing against him. He just can't do it. You can give him moderator. You can give him admin. But just to give him community manager is just a joke. To give him community manager would just mean we're a fucking joke. But, you know... He didn't want to listen. And so, I left. So that's why I left. But not just me, but everyone else who heard the news and were upset because, you know. But just don't just hear it from me. Hear it from other people who have had different views, different, different experiences with the same bullshit that I have been dealing with, that everyone else has been dealing with. I'm just tired. I'm, I'm going to sleep, dog. Hear it from Kissam. Meltier hired children, genuine 12 year olds. Alright, Zok should not be always listening to Meltier. He may say he's in charge, but he lets Meltier run everything. He sometimes mod abuses and no one does anything about it. And the new CM, yay, no CM is supposed to be for someone who knows the community, who interacts with it for a long time, not just five seconds. I hope you change and realize why we left. The reason why I left to put it simply is because I cannot in good mind work for someone who is willing to make changes to their staff without informing them, especially large changes. I cannot stand to the side and accept it when someone is blatantly ignoring the efforts of others and decides to reward someone who is known to cause problems in the staff team. I cannot and will not work with Meltier who is known to cause problems within the staff team and within the community. As of today I will be leaving and not returning unless this matter is resolved properly. The FNAF co-op server used to be enjoyable, although with the lack of additions to the game and recent changes in moderation, it has spiked the downfall of the community. Most recently, I have subsided to the constant bickering about controversy, but this really makes me disappointed. I really just did not find the server that enjoyable anymore. Only like a few people were actually active on there most of the time. The rest were barely online or just did not interact with the community at all. And I think the work that the upper staff have been doing should be more noticed by the community instead of just simply clowning on them. I never wanted to let go of this community and I really wanted to see the game become something bigger. I would just like to say that the uh, whole upper staff has been very unprofessional with the whole thing and that honestly the mass bans and everything just makes it look like this server is a uh, shit show. Uh, I left the server out of respect for what you and family did for the server, it's just not the same anymore. The server is just boring now. I left because it's hardly active. A lot of members don't even socially interact unless there's a Robux event like the last to leave event a couple days ago. It's also problematic, many members just starting pointless arguments with each other, it's very annoying. One time I couldn't even post a shit post without someone saying, stop shit posting when there's an argument. To whoever told me that, people like you start shit for attention, many of these people aren't smart to take these types of things somewhere else and instead just do it publicly in front of others. Of course, I don't get why there's even a new community manager, I've never even seen him before in my life and he hasn't really said much. This message doesn't go towards every member obviously. I myself barely started getting active in the server, but I already dislike it. Meltier should not be one of the only few people to decide on something for the server. I think Meltier has really just been treating the part of the staff team that left like pure shit from the start to present of this situation like the sudden disappearance of five very well-known heads of the server is not too big of a deal and they can just be replaced or something. It is hard to word how exactly I feel because I am, not a native English speaker but I imagine that other bystanders know what emotion I am trying to express here disappointment or disgust. Something like those. Alright, so um, 
really Milter is a bad um moderator and stuff. And um he kinda on um, racist too. He he literally says get back to work and he on um, immediately deleted right after like I didn't see that before. I left that damn server because I want to support a community of people who respect each other. However the shit I saw wasn't very respectful of the wonderful people who actually cared about the server and its people. Meltier is a piece of shit that wants to be an absolute dickhead and abuse his power on people who are just trying to live their life. I can't side with people who only care about themselves. We need a community of love and that's why I support Mick and Ethan on leaving that shithole, I would have done the same if I wear them. Nah I have nothing to think of. To be honest, I remember you guys being hardworking community managers for a while, then new CM joins like, why? I feel like the new CM change was unnecessary in the backstab to all the previous staff who worked their asses off to create a good and welcoming community. When 5 staff just suddenly disappear Meltier expects people not to question why and punish people who try to spread the truth. You are also just a dick to all the members in general, go fuck yourself Meltier. Honestly Meltier, if you see this you need to take a step back from this hiring children to work on the game is really not ethical especially when it was not an actual application and you just hired him out of the blue. So yeah fuck you as well as Z0KTAR you people should manage your community better especially at the top of ranks you need to do better. Please improve the handling of public servers you fucking twats. Yeah, the reason why I um, left the server in the first place is because none of the staff members that I like um, was in there anymore and the fact that they didn't like the server itself it said a lot of things, but I left because um, because of the bad interactions and conversations that I had about Miltier and I just wasn't okay with it. And the fact that he went from administrator to a straight up head staff was just suspicious and I don't trust it. Because um, he was very known to abuse his power and just silencing people up while also breaking the rule the ser the like the server's rule which is could be saying the n-word abusing power but the fact that he has basically plot armor and not able to get consequences because of the owner protecting him as well i just don't feel like going to the server anymore i don't want to be there anymore unless you know meltier has learned or he is not with power anymore and um the fact the fact that someone can be a developer and still abuse power is just insane to me. And the fact that just because he's a developer doesn't mean he has to be a role that has power. Because I get that, you know, you want to be nice to the developer and give them, like, admin powers, but what's the point of there? it's just going to destroy your own server, you know? But that's all I have to say for right now. But I just hope that, you know, people would take their role seriously instead of making them hate it, you know? But, yeah. Oh my god, guys, it's that time! Another sex to add! Welcome. I'm your host, one Mick one M six K ass hat here, and I and welcome to Melt 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 Meltier sucks ass. On this episode of Meltier sucks ass, look at the shit. Screenshot my DMs now. I get. Oh my God! Shut up, nerd emoji. Sorry, mail later. I got the receipts right here. You bald bastard. You subhuman piece of trash. Twelve million years. Of but don't worry, we got your strongest Meltier supporters here to show how much we love you. Hey, low-key, the motherfuckers Melter and Zoktar are ops now. You see them, it's my own site with the motherfuckers. They bitches. Meltier, you're a dipshit and you're bald. You're bald. The leader, a bitch. Also, Meltier, did you see this? Get it together, man. Stop being such a cunt.